I personally have experienced more patients die within the past two weeks than I have had patients die in the last six months. Baptist Health is one of the largest hospital systems in the state of Florida, now treating more than five times as many COVID patients as they were compared to this time last month, and more than 90% of them have not been vaccinated. CDC Director Rochelle Walensky sounding the alarm on the Delta variant. It is one of the most infectious respiratory viruses we know of and that I have seen in my 20 year career. Florida is experiencing the nation's most significant increase in new case numbers and hospitalizations. New cases are up by 490% over the last month, daily hospital admissions up by nearly 55% in the last week alone. Dr. Michelle Aquino says numbers in Jacksonville are skyrocketing and that 99.9% .9 of her hospital's patients have not been vaccinated. They're getting sicker faster and we're seeing a lot of these younger people in the ICU and we're seeing deaths in younger people. When you see someone under 40 die because of COVID, when there's a vaccine they could have gotten to prevent it, that breaks your heart. Missouri reporting a 234% jump in new virus cases over the last month. Some cities tightening restrictions. New Orleans and Philadelphia joining Los Angeles, now recommending that vaccinated people wear masks indoors, although the CDC is sticking to their mask guidelines for now. You may choose to add an extra layer of protection by putting on your mask, and that's a very individual choice. Authorities say at least five structures from this quiet Colorado neighborhood were completely destroyed, and you see this destruction here behind me. That's a roof. There is a tree that's been completely uprooted. And if you keep walking, you can see somebody's bathroom right here. The wall is still intact. They have lights and a mirror still there. This kind of devastation is something a community like this has not seen before. Monsoon storms dumping more than two inches of rain an hour in the west, creating dangerous flash flood conditions in Nevada and Arizona. In Colorado, rescuers are racing to find three missing people authorities believe were swept away during powerful flash floods and mudslides in rustic Colorado on Tuesday. The body of a woman already recovered by search and rescue teams. It's just it's totally devastating. This appears to be somebody's living room. The coffee table still intact. The board games are still stacked up. You see that chair with the blanket over the edge and a lamp nearby. It's actually still sitting on the carpet. But down here, you can see buried in rocks, mud, and a tree is their roof. Mudslides closing several roads and highways throughout the state as they brace for a wet weekend ahead. It's overwhelming. You can't even imagine.